Let's say we want to determine the equation of a line with an x-intercept of 3 and y-intercept of negative 4. We want the linear equation in slope-intercept form, which is y equals mx plus b, where m is the slope and b is the y-intercept. There are two ways to approach this. Let us first take a look at it graphically. The line intersects the y-axis at the point 0, negative 4. This verifies that the y-intercept is equal to negative 4. If we move from the point 0, negative 4 to the point 3, 0, we move 4 units up and 3 units to the right. This means the vertical change is 4 and the horizontal change is 3. This verifies that the slope is 4 thirds. Now we can determine the equation of the line in slope-intercept form. The equation of the line in slope-intercept form is y equals 4 thirds x minus 4. Now let us take a look at it algebraically. Since we could identify two points on the line, we can use the formula m equals y sub 2 minus y sub 1 all over x sub 2 minus x sub 1 in order to find the slope of the line passing through these points. Let the point 3, 0 be our x1, y1 and the point 0, negative 4 be our x2, y2. The slope of the line is going to be equal to the ratio of the change in y to the change in x, or m is equal to negative 4 minus 0 all over 0 minus 3. m is equal to negative 4 all over negative 3. m is equal to 4 thirds. Note that we were actually given the y-intercept, which is negative 4. We have enough information to write the equation of the line in slope-intercept form. The equation of the line in slope-intercept form is y equals 4 thirds x minus 4.